Ciao everyone! Beth with Thimblehooks, I'm back again. Now I'm going to go through the three bags of stuff that I got at Tuesday morning. Almost everything was on clearance. They had a huge clearance area of just miscellaneous things, but tons of tons and tons of yarn. The first ones that I found, this is from Universal Yarn. And originally these are this is a $15 hank of wool. 50% acrylic and 50% superwash wool. I usually don't work with wool, straight out wool like this, but this is just, this was such a pretty color. It says excellent for socks, shawls, and accessories. So let's see what it needs. Okay, it's a three weight, and they want me to use a four millimeter hook. Well, that seems reasonable. 291 yards, they only had two, so I got both of them, but almost 600 yards, I know I can come up with something fun. I don't know what it will be yet, but that's what my favorite things to do is design. So that's what we're going to start doing. Put set those aside for a minute. There's the next one. This is also from Universal Yarn. See, these have been loved. This is what happens when you get things on clearance. Sometimes people pull the yarn out. They just got jostled around a little bit too much. But I have a ball winder, so I'm not even concerned. I already know what I'm going to do with these two. So this is going to be your typical four weight. It's a very gradiated pink. And it feels a lot like a carrot, like a simply soft or a red heart. There's anything extra special about it except that it's pink, and I love pink. And they only had two of them, and they needed they needed a good home. Oh, poor thing. Set those aside for a moment. More universal yarn. They had two of these. They look and feel oh just like landscapes, lime brand la landscapes. They have the gradiated colors. This one is called Stained Glass, I believe, which is a perfect name. Yep, Stained stained Glass. And they want me to use a six millimeter and a four medium. So again, it's like a landscape, so it's a little fuzzy, so you want a little bit bigger hook. I put in pictures so you can see these just gorgeous colors all swirled together. They're beautiful. Here's another one from the Universal Yarn People. This one's called Classic Shades, just like that other one was. This one's name is Grapevine. This also is looking and feeling just like landscapes. Look from the Lion Brand people. It, it's a little bit fuzzy. It's got the great colors. This one's called Grapevine. Perfect name. Very purple. It looks to me kind of like um, Mardi Gras colors all mixed together. That's what caught my eye on that one. Great shades of purple and some deep greens. So I'm going to love this three of them on clearance so I'll come up with a great project and then one lonely little landscapes from Lion Brand a real landscapes you can see right here this is a it's a four and they want a six and a half millimeter so it's a little, they're asking for a little bit bigger hook I didn't know they made just black I always thought they had the swirly colors that's what I've always used before I've never seen one that's just black so this is really going to be fun but everybody knows this lovely product and I got it for uh, about I'm going to say about 80 to 85 percent off of the normal price that you would buy it anywhere else. So it's mine now. That's so great. And now I have these. These are called the Hook Nook. Again, I don't know. I haven't used this product before. Really squishy. It's called Yummy. What a great name. It's been loved a little bit. Ripped, but I don't care. So this is telling me it's a five. It's a bulky. That makes total sense to me. Okay, it's a six, six and a half millimeter, which sounds right. It had three of them for me, and this is a great pink. What is it called? Cherry Blossom. That's a great color name. Cherry Blossom. It's kind of a, uh, it's pink, but it's it's a, uh, it's definitely a little swirly. It was more of a raspberry kind of color mixed into it. So I'll take a picture up close so you'll be able to see these. I had three of those. And now these little guys are so cute. These little buns. I love these little buns. Universal Yarn People, Vibrance. This is a super fine. I don't see it as being a super fine exactly, but it's calling it a one. It is pretty thin. It's kind of fluffy. It's got two strands twisted. One of them is really fuzzy and the other one is really thin. It almost looks like thread. Uh, they want me to use a three and a half millimeter hook. Oh, that's fun. Called Vibrance. And I'm looking for the name of the color. Okay, I guess the color name is Fractal. It's gradiated pink to purples. Again, they were 20% off of the Tuesday morning price, which is always a always a great price in the first place. 
that Tuesday morning. So then they gave me an extra 20% off. But this one is called Vitamin. What a goofy cup, goofy name. But it's another little bun. It has the same pinks in it. Same little, yeah, same different shades of pink. But instead of purple, it had gold. And I figured, well, those are close enough that they can coordinate and be friends. So that's going to be something cute. I know, I know it will be. But I'm going to put those three away. And I also found the same vibrance in the blues, blueberry. Again, this was a one, and they want me to use a three and a half millimeter. See those great blues and kind of a little bit of a steel gray in there and some great blues. They had a, several of them, so I got them all. A couple of them look like they've been loved a little bit. So I've got well, two of them that are perfect and three of them that are a little floppy, but again, I have a ball winder. I don't care as long as they're not in big knots and I don't see any knots. I'm going to put those away. Another one that's been loved very much. Oh, poor thing. But he has a happy home now. Carrot cakes. We've got cakes all over the place. They had they had just piles of cakes. So they're saying that this is a five millimeter hook. Everybody knows a Karen cake. And this one is pistachio fudge, which is probably right. There's that's definitely definitely the greens and the chocolatey cocoa colors. This oh this side looks way prettier. They only had one, and it is how long are you? 383 yards. This one isn't calling out to me quite yet. Some of the other ones just say, make me into this. This one isn't calling to me yet, but he has a happy home because he looked like he needed it. Poor little yarn. And then what else did I get? Oh, these are Burnett cake. Got three of these. They're huge. The Burnett Pop Bulkies. And I want an eight millimeter hook because these are super bulky. This is a six super bulky with my 10 millimeter. Yep. So this color is Fabulous Fuchsia. Never can resist anything that's pink, so that was easy. This was a no-brainer. This, I think it jumped into my cart. I didn't even have to put it in my cart. I had three of them, so this will make something really fun. Make a big squishy blanket or something like that. Then I've got these. These really had a hard life until they got to come join my stash. This one is all shrink-wrapped back together again. This one's little label is all a mess, but labels... Labels are not important to me. I don't care. But this is Burnett Blanket Stripes. This one is called Buffed Stone. Oh, that's good. That's a good name. I have two of them. This one is all shrink wrap, but there's no damage. He's actually in better shape than this one that's not, so that's funny. There's some, they're just kind of gray, like a clay, kind of sandy colors, and then there's the darker brown. And this is a really dusty, a deep dusty blue. It's not, it doesn't look like it's totally gray. It has a little bit of a blue tinge into it. Well, definitely, um, it will find a happy place. So there's those two. Now these I had never seen before. Karen Tea Cakes. They had two of them. They're a six, super bulky. They want me to use an eight millimeter hook. I might use a little bit bigger on it because it seems like it's, it's pretty heavy. I'll give it a try and then I'll see what my chains look like when I start doing something. This one's called Maple matcha, which is kind of a fun name. That's kind of fun. Like matcha tea, I guess. It has the greens and a lot of kind of a golden browns, kind of an olive green. So again, the fall colors are just jumping out at me. So I have two of those. 204 yards. There's a lot of stuff in here. This is big. So I'm excited by those. I'll put a picture in for everybody to see. And these are, I don't know why they had all these cakes. I'm so excited. Look at all these cakes. Everybody knows Karen Cakes. I have four and they're all the same color, which is awesome. Turkish Delight. Okay, that's a good name. Kind of got a golden color, cream color. This is a, a dusty plum, a blue, a pink, and then starts over at the gold with the cream again. I have four of these. It's a four weight, which seems right. 383 yards each. Ooh. And I only want me to use a five millimeter hook. But I have four of those. So that will definitely make something. But again, Karen cakes. Four of them just sit in there for about 80% off. Which I can't complain about that ever. That's never going to go wrong. The last thing that's coming out of my little bag stash thing here right that I have right now. They're Karen big cakes. These things are huge. 300 grams. There's tons of them. 603 yards and I have three of them. How much fun is that going to be? Again, these were a little loved. 
they're a little bit out of out around. They've had some they've had some manhandling, but I don't care. There doesn't seem to be any damage, and there's no knots. I can fix I can fix that. This is a four weight, which looks exactly right. I like it. these are soft. I like it. I love Karen products. Simply Soft is one of my favorite products to work with every day, any day. I will always work with the Karen Simply Soft. I just love it. Um, so this is a four medium. They want me to use a five and a, uh, five millimeter hook, and I certainly will. It sounds perfect. This one is called oh, Tiramisu. There's like a camel and a, a like a buff color in here. A couple of shades of gray and a cream. So that'll be fun. Those are just going to make some really nice stripes. Probably just be a great big huge throw and be really 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 soft. I'm excited by that. 20% off of their already low price. So again, I'm going to my quick math tells me about 80% off of normal, which I'm going to take every day. Even if it wasn't something that I was looking for in the first place, it's gonna turn into a cool project at some point. That's how I found a few yarns that I do love right now that I like working with because they're on clearance and I gave them a try. This haul that I just got is loaded with things I've never used before so it should be really fun. Um, again that was what I accidentally found when I went to Tuesday morning. I had no idea they were gonna have all of this stuff on clearance. I'm gonna start designing as soon as I find a place for these because it was hard enough to put away the stuff from Joann's and Hobby Lobby a couple of minutes ago. But anyway, thanks for stopping by. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for supporting my small business, and I hope to see you soon. Thanks. Bye. Have a great day.